Hey guys, it's Lee here and welcome to iMind Blocks. So it's a super exciting day today because I'm announcing the winner of the RTX 2070 graphics card, which is this thing here, and I've been banging on about it for the last two weeks. So you'd be pleased to know that uh, towards the end of this video, I'll be releasing or announcing the winner of this graphics card, and it's gonna be one of you guys that was using the Kudo uh, Miner. So just before I get to that part, there's a few other different pieces in this video, um, including a nice little bonus for you guys. Even if you didn't win the graphics card, it's still gonna be a good bonus uh, for another one of you guys um, anyway. So uh, let's take a quick look at a couple of different things. I want to talk about a few updates on the Kudo Miner. I also want to show you guys my earnings with my GTX uh, 1080 Ti. So what that earnings have been like over the past two weeks. And also how my 1080 Ti uh, compares against that RTX uh, 2070 that one of you guys is going to be winning. So let's uh, jump into it. Okay, so I have been mining with the Kudo Miner for uh, the past two weeks. So I've not been mining with it 100%. I've been using the graphics card. This is my workstation and I've been using it for other things um, during that time as well. Um, but over that period of time, I've earned uh, 874,522 Satoshi. So that's how much I've earned with the Kudo Miner. Now, to be honest with you, the vast majority of that is based on referrals, uh, commissions, and not necessarily all mining. So I'll show you that um, in, in more detail in just a moment. A couple of the cool features that Kudo have brought out or updates is first and foremost, they've uh, reintroduced the XM rig miner. So they took that out during the Monero uh, fork because there were some complications with it. They've re put that back in. So if you guys want to mine a Monero using the latest and fastest miners uh, possible, you can do that with Kudo. The other thing that they added in also is uh, the latest uh, Claymore miners. So again, that obviously gives you uh, more mining potential. You're gonna be using the latest and greatest miners integrated within Kudo. The other thing that's quite cool as well is they've changed the uh, kind of like the mining dashboard. So if I show you on uh, the devices, it'll open up the web browser and kind of logs into the Kudo Miner, um, the, the web uh, interface. And then from here, you can select, I've obviously only got the one um, machine, but from here, you can select your machines and they're kind of constantly adding new things to it. So I think in the future, it'll be a bit more like a SMOS or um, like Hive OS uh, dashboard and you'll be able to do a lot more um, features like restarting your rigs and things like that. At the moment, there's only a few sort of uh, basic features that you can do with it, but they are adding new features all the time. So I think that's quite interesting that you'll be able to effectively remote manage your rigs. Like I say, at the moment, it's a work in progress, but um, it's definitely something to keep uh, an eye on. So earnings over this past two weeks. So if I go to the dashboard from the Kudo Miner, you can see this is my personal earnings over this period of time. So we've got, um, what day was the video made on? I think it was, yeah, it must've been the 1st um, of March. So you can see here the blue um, parts of the chart, they are my mining uh, uh, earnings. So you can see on March 1st, it's 1,300, uh, sorry, 13,851. Satoshi's. 2nd of March, it's 19,700 or so, and it continues on there. So the mining performance pretty much every day was roughly about 20,000 or Satoshi's or just under. You can see some days towards the end, it's quite a bit less. Uh, that's where I've been using the workstation for other things, uh, particularly on March 13th. Um, I spent all night working on the Monero miner and stuff like that. So there was no earnings on this machine um, during that time. But you can kind of see the performance um, over time. What you guys have really noticed is that obviously, you know, for me, um, I've got a very good um, bonus uh, referrals uh, commissions, and that's obviously because a lot of you guys kind of, you know, use the miner, so that's a bonus um, to me. So you can see the red bar is the bonus, so that's for all the re referral uh, bonuses, and also the yellow stack is commissions, so that's um, a tiny percentage of what you guys actually mined. So I think it roughly works out to about 1%, something like that. So the current balance here is uh, 874,509 Satoshis. So you guys that have been paying attention at least this far into the video, which has uh, just been a few minutes already. So there's a bit of Bitcoin there, it's roughly worth about $35, something like that. So one of you guys uh, is gonna win that. All you need to do, super simple, is put a comment down below this video and include your Bitcoin address. At the end of the day today, um, I'm just gonna withdraw my balance from the Kudo Miner and I'm gonna send it to one of you guys. So, yeah, I mean, 
yeah, I just want to give you guys a bit extra. So all of the money that I've kind of earned and from the referrals and all that sort of stuff, you know, arguably I've kind of got that from you guys. So now I'm going to give it back to you one of you. So yeah, add your Bitcoin address in the comments below. I'll pick one of you guys at the end of the day and I'll send it out to you. Um, I probably won't do a follow up video on that. I'll just, um, I'll just update it on YouTube or Twitter or whatever, let you guys know who won. Okay, so the next part is uh, GTX 1080 Ti performance versus the graphics card that one of you use is going to win. So virtually it's kind of my graphics card versus this brand new one that one of you guys has uh, got to win. So I've created this beautiful chart that shows you the information that you need to see. So from the top you can see the power draw. So this is going to be crucial for you guys. If you want a, a good, solid and efficient miner, power draw is super important. And generally with each generation of graphics cards, it gets more and more efficient. So that's what you can see here. So the 2070 uses on average about 150 watts, whereas my 1080 Ti is using about 190. So quite a big difference, almost 25% difference or 25% more efficient just in power. Looking further down, you can see I've done, um, or got the benchmarking information from a few different sources. So you can see there's Lara, uh, which is for Verquen. Uh, the 2070 is at 60.5 hashes versus 77. Uh, for Ravencoin, uh, very similar performance, 26 versus 29. Um, again there, I think there's quite a bit of um, room for improvement. Uh, my 1080 Ti does actually run quite a bit um, higher than that, and I think the 2070 will also perform better with a little bit of um, overclocking. And by the way, these are just the standard kind of figures, uh, not, not too much in there. Kukuru, very close, 6 versus 6.3. Um, again, I've had my 1080 Ti up to about 7, so I think you'd also be able to get slightly better improvement on this uh, 2070 here also. Next up is Monero Kryptonite R algorithm, which is a new algorithm. Um, I don't really recommend mining this on Nvidia cards because the Vegas are so much faster. Uh, Vegas are um, hashing at like 2000 hashes uh, using similar uh, power sort of ratios. But anyway, the 2070 gets around about 700 hashes and my uh, 1080 Ti is uh, 750. Uh, further down the bottom, we've got the Ethereum hash rate. So it's obviously Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, etc. Uh, 2070 performs at 36.9 hashes and the 1080 Ti uh, with the ETH enlargement pill uh, you're getting closer to 50. So I just wanted to do a quick comparison there uh, just kind of show you guys what you get. Well, one of the important things to kind of note is that when the uh, 1080 was out that graphics card was roughly around about a thousand pounds new whereas this is um, under 500 pounds. So that you know you're basically getting very similar performance at half the price uh just to also make you aware i purchased my 1080 ti uh, actually used and it still cost 500 pounds so still cost more than this one when it was used and you know getting the same sort of performance so whoever wins this card um you guys are going to be off to a great start with your mining okay guys so i am super excited so let's find out who the winner is of this graphics card so Who's going to win our RTX 2070? So the team at Kudo, they've provided me a list of uh, the guys that were using the miner from that referrals list that I already mentioned. So I've looked for the list. There's quite a few names in there that I recognize. I've seen the names in the comments and on Discord. And there's also quite a lot of names that I have never, never seen before or at least not shown in the comments or anything like that. So there's a, a good list, a good number of people. A little bit disappointed that a few people uh, sort of used the link but then didn't use the miner. So unfortunately you guys um, don't count. I did say that you do have to use the miner. So unfortunately you guys are excluded. But anyway, so I've got a list of uh, you guys that are in that list and I'm gonna use a, a random number picker to pick someone from that list. So I've got an Excel spreadsheet with um, all of the usernames and I've got a website that can pick random numbers. So let's, uh, we've entered the criteria. So we want one random number. And the random number is 34. So we're gonna have a look at our Excel spreadsheet. Scrolling down, there are all the names. Who is number 34? There we go. Number 34, the Bitcoin username is, uh, sorry, the username is Bitcoin 
2019. Bitcoin 2019, I have no idea who that person is. I've not seen that name before, but you are our winner. So congratulations, Bitcoin 2019 is the winner. So, uh, you know, going by that username, hopefully Bitcoin 2019 is a winner for all of us guys. So congratulations. And the team over at Kudo, they will be emailing you and following up, um, obviously, to get your address details as such. Um, you can also email me um, and we'll just kind of link everything together. So it's riskyfire2 at gmail.com. Email me and I'll connect everything together and I'll make sure your uh, prize gets sent out to you. So congratulations and thanks to all of you guys for taking part. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. Uh, again, thank you so much to Kudo for providing uh, not only the great software, but also the prize to give to one of you guys. It's really good of them to support me, the channel, and you guys, um, so I really do appreciate that. And for you guys, obviously everyone that took part, you know, it is a good good opportunity for you guys to, you know, at least you was in with a chance, you had a very good odds of winning. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Till then, take care and bye-bye.